All right, GoPro maintenance. While I was welding, I don't know if I can catch it in the light, you can see a couple little dots just on the upper right side of the lens there. There's a couple little dots on the screen that I'm not gonna be able to get out. But uh, welding slag got up into that. So I bought a new protective lens replacement kit that covers all of them and also the actual black beetle here so we'll see how these things look and go on here so the black beetle looks like they give you all right so it looks like some sort of a little lens cover i'm not sure what's what what i bought i know i bought a new new lens for it I'm not sure which these are. So this looks like it's just a lens cover. So once it's protected, it's done. So when I'm not filming, we can throw this bad boy on there. So that's what the Black Beetle looks like. Looks like it's on there pretty good. And that's just friction. It looks like, you know, it doesn't look like it really clips onto anything. So just friction for that. And then new protective lens replacement for the Hero 9 Black. This is actually a GoPro licensed product. So let me cut into it real quick. Okay, so ripped into that bad boy. And it looks like this is the actual new lens. So if you don't know how the lens comes off on this, you just twist it, and this just twists off. Twist it a quarter turn, and that comes off, so there's my old lens. And then, and then, and then, oh man, I lost my little gasket. So apparently there's a little gasket on there. And, I'm guessing the little gasket goes on here. Okay, so new lens is on. That's great. And it just has these metal metal bars on both sides, the right and left there in the frame, that kind of go over and that makes it clip down on there and hold it tight. This O-ring though in the center it would not let it go down on there. So it didn't have one when I took the old one out. Um, I didn't see that it's got anything special on the back side of that. So um, I'm running it without. I don't know if uh, somebody from GoPro or somebody that knows GoPros a little better than I do knows that you need this in there. Let me know. But um, I'm running without. So now I'm going to put these little these little black beetle screen savers on there and see what happens. Looks like they give you two sets here. So I've got one set out for the three screens and I've got another set of three screens still in the pack there. So uh, gonna wet wipe it up and then see how it goes transferring them on there. This thing's done over a hundred videos for us. And then we had to go welding with it and weld everything and get slag all over it. And I just, uh, oh, there is a smudge on the lens there. Just a little, so I'm going to wipe it too. Just a little bit wet there. Let's see if we've got a little dustless rag to wipe on it. And what do you know, it's included in the package. Glasses lens cleaner. Looks pretty good. Yeah, you can see all that garbage on the screen. Get the light reflecting just right. Yeah, see all that garbage on that screen. So I'd like to keep it nicer. So this looks pretty good, the reflection in that. 
Looks pretty good. So. I'm liking that. And this is probably gonna be as good as it can get. I'll wipe it again with some moist towel that they provide. That's probably about as good as I'm gonna get it. Let's do this side too. Wipe it again. I'll hit it with this. Looks pretty clean, pretty good. Just laid it on there. You can see it almost there. It is bottom right corner. Just sucked itself all the way down on. So I just laid it in this corner over here, and then it just straight on. So that was very cool. All right, I'm happy. Screen protectors on the back. Now let's get the front done. Okay, one more time with the wipety wiperoo here. Okay, and then you pull out one of these guys, and it says on it, it says if you can't read it. Step one. Remove mask film. Let's see if you can see it. Remove mask film attached to this tab. So, and then this little guy is for the box. I'm just gonna try to line him up. Oh, maybe he's for that box. Yep, I think so. So with the other one, I just got it basically started right down on that edge. And then it did its magic. You can see in the corner there, it's starting. And it just laid out for me. The back one did at least. Looks pretty dandy. Got it on there just a smidge crooked. But it's on there. Checked it good enough. And I'm no professional. Alright, so this one is a little smaller for this guy. And remove this first. We'll go ahead and hit it with the old dust absorber which is a sticker basically okay dust has been absorbed and i really don't see anything on this new lens so that's cool so i'll take the back off I'm just gonna kind of press it onto there. And that looks pretty dandy. I don't see that there's any air bubbles in there gonna cause the video to distort in any way, shape, or form. So yeah, there's your install of the Black Beetle system. 
pretty nice. Looks pretty good. Let me wipe the outside with the thing so you can see it shined up here real quick. And yeah, I pulled out the wrong one. So that, I put the sticker back on it. That's, there's three different sizes in there and I pulled out two of the same size, so. We will clean this guy up. Looks good. Yep, looks good. All right, so this is the video filming with the GoPro with the new lens on it. So no more splotchy garbage. And looks to be pretty clear. Yep. Happy with it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.